really, Alucard is the bat sidekick, if anything. True. Yeah, the the thing that I the the thing that I remember from Dracula is that Jonathan Harker is uh is definitely an NB, and uh, Chapter Five had that like scene where the three uh, vampire thralls of Dracula like came to him and tried to have their way with him. Oh yeah. And what happened? Uh, Dracula came and was like, hey, knock it off, you nerds. <laughs> no fucking in my castle. <laughs> I'm not sure that's the way they intended to have it. Uh, <laughs> well, yeah, okay. I just... Vampire ladies, please. True, true. <laughs> <laughs> the no horny police. One of the conditions of being Dracula is you can never fuck. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna grab my rings. I'll be right back. It's time. It's time! <laughs> I get it. <laughs> how, how did Alucard get here, you ask? Well, listen. Shh. It's fine. Alucard uh, is here through Parthenogenesis. <laughs> huh. I don't... Now I'm concerned. I have another ring. I don't know where I put it. In, in vitro parthenogenesis. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my gosh. Where's my ring? I don't... Oh well. I thought I'd have to make do with like copper, but I actually have um, <laughs> some kind of gold ish ring and silver ish rings. Let's see. I think this will fit on my pinky. Barely. And barely. There we go. I did it. Nice. Now you can go into the clock. <laughs> Enter the clock. Become time. Oh, yes. Wear clock in tower. Is the sprite for the Ring of Ares just have the number 24 <laughs> on it? Because <laughs> they had no idea how to make it visually distinct. It's like, uh, 24 men, there you go. Ring of 24. How do we make a ring that looks like it would make the Ring of 24 be strong? I think I'm supposed to go this way. The clock strikes 13. Honestly, thank you so much for being here, because I notice things. <laughs> I definitely noticed the number of the number of bongs. <laughs> yeah, let's go back to this. No, but uh, yeah, there we go. This <laughs> keepers of the ring. This this game may or may not have been my life for a few years. Oh, understandably, it would have been um, if I could have actually owned a copy. Yeah. 
I do have a copy of the soundtrack on CD. That was. Does it have the like? Does it have the like data disc audio track? It doesn't. No. Which is really oh, disappointing. That's a bummer. It's like, how can you call it a complete collection when you don't have the secret track? Well, probably Michiru Yamana didn't have anything to do with it. Maria. Mm. So it's fine. Sorry, you were right. He has joined forces with the enemy. Alucard. <laughs> so it was a Belmont after all. But no, wait, isn't this where where she him. reveals Whatever she's Elvira? We, we can't harm Richter. But he must be stopped. I know. <laughs> Tell me where the well, bomb is. <laughs> Take these with you. What are these? But if you wear these, you can see beyond evil illusions. Thank you. It is best that if you pray for the soul of your friend. Hi, Maria. <laughs> All right, my housemates are back, so I'm gonna close the door to my room. Okie dokie. Like the. Gosh. Oh, it's been. I moved out in January. Sometimes I still have the instinct, like, when I enter the computer room to close the door behind me, even though I don't need to, because I live alone. Yeah. It's just, like, drilled in. I don't, I don't like having to close the door if I don't need to. Yeah, then it gets all stuffy and, like... Just kind of feels a little more claustrophobic. Yeah, like know. it's a, it's like a psychological thing for me. I don't know, like <laughs> I just like it when the doors are not closed. Yes, I'm with you on that. Okay, I can go up to the warp point. Ah, this jump is the worst. There we go. I did it. I found out how you're supposed to do that in the speed run, but then I forgot like immediately afterward. Um You're supposed to be able to dive kick off of the can like use a use a bug to give you a dive kick before you have the leap stone. Okay. That's a very good bug. Probably yeah. got cute little wings. I don't know. I like bugs. <laughs> I love that big weapon weapon master enemy also. The one with the giant hammer or the one who throws his sword? The the one with the one that's like in the center of the room that has like all of the weapons surrounding it. Oh yes! Oh yes! The sword which will command all other weapons. Yeah. Tag yourself, I'm the cool looking Warhammer. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm definitely a spear of some sort. Yeah. I know Emma's a sword. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Val. The Falchion. God, I, I tense up with such anxiety every time I have to say that word out loud because I'm like, oh gods. There might be a Falchion. I don't even know what all they have. I know there was a scythe and a whip and uh, the warhammer, and I'm sure there's a spear and a sword also. Should I go back? I feel like there is um. <laughs> What's that like little hand scythe? Oh, uh, comma. Yeah, oh. comma. For some reason, my brain's telling me that was in the mix too. 
I believe it. What am I doing? Oh yeah, holy glasses. Putting on your specs. <laughs> so you can see the evil. You can use my orb vision. <laughs> but you know, like ones that have been ordained by the church. This is the only <laughs> holy way to view opera. Answer me. Why is a Belmont planning the resurrection of Count Dracula? Count Dracula rises but once every century, and my role is over. If I can resurrect him, then the battle will last for eternity. If those are your true feelings, then so be it. Hey, Trevor Belmont, you get to have two sub weapons. <laughs> Here we go, I just gotta... Gotta break his balls. What is it? I think he's being <laughs> a little confused there. <laughs> but all is not yet lost. The resurrection of Count Dracula is at hand. <laughs> Shaft is here. <laughs> Shit, it's Shaft. <laughs> now we get a different cutscene. They're gonna. <laughs> the tips are gonna touch. <laughs> Sorry, I'm the worst. No. What have I done? Thank you, Alucard, for saving Richter. Alucard? The same Alucard who fought alongside my ancestor, <laughs> Trevor Belmont? That was over 300 years ago. No time for small talk. Is the person who controlled you in that castle over there? Yes, I think so. Maria, take Richter and leave here. <laughs> I'll this. All I right. no time for Good small luck. talk after he's like, <laughs> my father or my ancestor from 300 years ago fought with you. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I don't care about your family bullshit. <laughs> Elicard considers that small talk is just great. Like, what do vampires get to talking about over over the millennia? Very old books. <laughs> Oh, constantly. Well, humans would just, like, stop fucking literally everything up. Yeah. Valid criticism, honestly. <laughs> like, sure, vampires, they'll kill humans. Oh no, they'll hurt people. We're gonna destroy the fucking world. <laughs> vampires mind their own business mostly. Yeah. This is the like we're preparing you for this this new new level of difficulty here room. Mhm. Mm uh, was that what I got the bastard sword? Yeah, you got the bastard sword. That's definitely better than. Uh... Ooh, I do have an ice brand. Sword? Yeah, I was using the hunting sword. I think I use the ice brand though. I forgot though. that you switched to that. Ice brand's pretty good. And I get a pretty new cloak. It's not, I don't know, it's not quite as pretty as the crystal cloak, though. Oh, the cloak. It's actually, like, wasn't the reversible cloak similar colors? It's, it's like a darker, 
uh, less saturated. Oh yeah. Huh. That actually doesn't look nearly as good for being a royal cloak. The royal cloak has got like a subtle green color on the inside that I really like. And I wish that you could wear that color on the outside. Hmm, I just gotta save up my 30,000 golds. We can have any color you want. So you can get the cloak of Joseph or whatever? Yes. <laughs> Joseph's amazing Technicolor dream coat. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I upset poor Yorick. Skull. Skull. Oh, um, I love... Is it... I can't remember if it's Arya or Dawn of Sorrow, but you, like, get the Yorick, um, soul, and you've gotta, like, slide kick the skull after you throw it. Yes. I remember, I remember Arya had the soul collecting thing. Did Dawn of Sorrow have that too? I'm pretty sure it did. I think it was a lot more grindy too. Cause, like, Arya's pretty, Arya's pretty grindy if you wanna get the <laughs> Dawn of Souls, Dark of Sorrow. DS. Yes. <laughs> I always thought it was kind of cute that um, when they'd like make DS games, they would try to incorporate DS into the title somehow. Like Resident Evil Deadly Silence, Dawn of yes. Sorrow. It's a little <laughs> yeah. goose like that. <laughs> Advance Wars Dual Strike. Yeah, yeah. It's like, um, like how Nintendo 64 games were all whatever 64, only less, um, a little classier. You have to get a little bit creative with it. Mm hmm. This is... the warp room? Yes. Heck yes. Take me away, keyhole. Oh. <laughs> it did not take me anywhere. <laughs> Dang, I, I guess you can only do that in the regular Where castle. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Valerie, that sounds adorable. You should record it for us all to enjoy. That does sound adorable. Uh, Gemma, Gemma Cat also has a very, very good squeak yawn. It puts me to shame. to it. Did you break, did you break that one in the regular birded castle? I'm pretty sure I did, yeah. But I thought like one of the ones along the um, along the bottom there would break too. Oh fuck yes, tombstones. The worst. <laughs> mm. 
And I just gotta do my little dance. Okay. That's true, wing smash or dog. Dog. Oh, here we go. It's this song. Uh, Lost Painting, I think? <laughs> Blocka. Makes you think of Tofu in Resident Evil 2. Oh my god. Best character. God bless Tofu. <laughs> have you seen have you seen Tofu in the remake? No, I have not. Oh, oh my god. Tofu is so jiggly. <laughs> amazing. It's amazing. And like um Tofu is so jiggly. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> is it and uh, when it gets hit, like chunks come out of it. So, you, so as Tofu, you take a green herb and you just grow back all of these chunks. It's the most oh amazing. <gasps> like you know, as one does. Yep, cute girl. I want to get stoned with this girl. Come on, I can't do my. Here we go. I just want to bounce on her head. <laughs> also, very good snake butt in this fight, I have to say. Oh my god, I just noticed the hair tail is a snake head too. Oh, it's adorable. Oh! Oh my gosh! Yes! Okay. Pay attention to fight. <laughs> I'm petrified. I agree, Valerie. I agree wholeheartedly. Yeah. Like, not enough games. Like let you smooch the enemies instead of fighting them. Yo, what? I didn't know those cats could do that. Slime cat. Oh yeah, slime cat. It makes them a, a real pain if you want to like get the item they draw. She's like, I'm gonna hit you, and cat's like, No, you're not. What did they draw? Um. Oh gosh, I can't. Remember. It's something good. Oh, the, um, the, 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 I almost kind of want to now, but I'm not. I'm not lucked out. Yeah. I'm not ready for item grinding. It's also kind of like a liability because it sets your defense to like. It, it gives you minus thirty four defense. Okay. Oh, I forgot about that. But it does give you like a hundred attack power, something like that. And then more, the more blood you feed it. Oh, is that the is that the sword? Does the, yeah. There's the more uh, masa. And there, there's also the masamune. Mas, masa, masamune. Okay, that, that's that's the one I that's the one I have. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, I tend to get those confused too. Yeah, it's. Um. But yeah, 
but yeah, like they. Uh, the Nora Masa, Masamune uh, is the one that cuts your defense by 34 and gives you 100 attack power, and the Murasama starts out at like, I don't know, like 24 attack power. Yeah, it starts out weaker than the Red Rust, and then you just grind squids until you can one-shot everything. Mm -hmm. Just keep grinding on those squids. Theoretically, in Depends how much squid grinding you want to do. <laughs> Alright, Ivy, I need your help. Um, Crystal Cloak or Twilight Cloak? Um, put the Twilight Cloak on. It's, it's the glowy. Oh, it's got a red lining. That's nice. Mm-hmm. So, like, they're both really pretty. How does that look like when you're in bat form? Uh, it also pulses in bat form, too. So it's real good. A little hard to see. Oh, that's really good. I love how that looks in bat form. Yes. All right, I'm going to stick with this then. Alucard's a classy bitch. <laughs> Red and black, it's the way to go. Classic vamp colors. And also, uh, you're going to get better capes in a moment. Oh? I don't know if it's actually as soon as I made it sound like, but... <laughs> <laughs> In mere seconds, you will get a better cape. Cloth <laughs> oh no, I did it. Eating that knockback. Oh gosh, what's going on? <laughs> Don't call yourself a true god unless you suck, <laughs> I mean, fair. <laughs> god, oh, little gremlins. No. Oh my god, you can play as the Tenchu Gal in uh, Sekiro. Ooh! Oh gosh, I'm... I'm like half tempted to pick up that game. But... I can't run it on my laptop, I'm sad. No! That's awful! <laughs> Come to my place and play it on my PC. Okay. Yay! Hi Gemma! <laughs> Oh no, not this again. I don't think we do have the spike breaker armor on still, by the way. Uh, no, I did, uh, I swapped that out. I'm just like, okay, so my, my feelings about Sekiro are, I don't want, I don't like where Dark Souls went after 2, like after, um, when, when Scholar and when 3, I was just not, not enjoying it anymore. <laughs> I liked Dark Souls 3, I skipped 2. And I, I tried to play too, but I had to skip it. Yeah, that's valid. I, I feel like it's different for everyone. Yeah, I, I, I agree with Valerie also. It, it was definitely more of a Tenchu game than a Dark Souls game. Hmm. Oh, so... Hmm. But also, 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 lest we forget, Bloodborne fucking slaps. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, the game I can't play because I refuse to buy consoles. 
Old PS4, that's... that is such a phrase. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you're old. <laughs> just, just have this old PS4 lying around. Yeah, and um... What was, what was the other thing? Uh, <clears throat> and then, like, I think Ava bought me a copy of Bloodborne. Oh, hell yeah. Play it for me. <laughs> hell yeah. That's very good. Oh, well, okay, see you later. I love these zombies. Yeah, I, I definitely did grow up playing all of the Tenchu games and all of them, so I want to play something a lot. Is it not on on the PS4? I mean, maybe it is, but uh, it's something that requires money. And, oh. uh, you know, I was, I was uh, playing it on PC via like Steam Library Share, or trying to play it on Steam, I should say. Hmm. When when you found out that it just wouldn't work. Yeah. Ooh. I don't know, there are too many video games. Ooh. I just saw the special attack that you did. Yeah! Fancy. Like, most of the time I just want to go back to the games I know, like Castlevania Symphony of the Night, and just play those again. <laughs> they just keep making it better. <laughs> like, come on, it's not fair. Oh, are you gonna fight Akmo Dan the second? Oh, you know it. <laughs> so the, the, it's like where like half of the speedrun time goes. Watching Akmo Dan the second die. <laughs> I like I remember that this fight exists now, but I can't. I can't recall anything about it beyond that. It's chest. Now you're in to everything. Yay! Now I just need the shield. And I pair that with the shield rod. And then I can't lose the game. It's impossible. Dark Souls 3 a lot, but I didn't actually have the time to beat it, because I was playing it at Ava's house while I was uh, visiting her in Utah. Oh. Oh, so that's why <laughs> What? Sorry, I was about to say something shitty. <laughs> anyway, uh, that's, that's, um, that's, that's my experience with Dark Souls. Uh, I did a, did a bunch of uh, co-op on it with, uh, with somebody else running me through uh, a, like a good chunk of it just to like show it to me. That's kind of sounds like the way to go. Yeah, I agree. My, I think maybe part of my problem with those games is like I gotta do it myself. I can't summon. That's cheating. I have to fight all these bosses solo. <laughs> oh, I, I I love summoning in that in uh, Souls game. It's cool. Like you can't get it online uh, at least when it comes to go off. But also, I had some fun with PvP also. There there is some fun to be had with the PvP. Um, it, especially with the uh, like you know the, the chaos demon or covenant or whatever the hell it was in Dark Souls Three. 
where like you're neither an intru uh you're neither like an ally or an intruder, but like you can attack them both. Oh yeah, you're just like you're basically just there to destroy, kill everything. Well, no. No, I sorry, I don't <laughs> know Dark Souls to do that well. You're there to do whatever you feel is the most fun. <laughs> okay. I got invaded by, um, they're, they're, they, they, they show up as, like, pink, you know, like, their soul effect or whatever. Mm -hmm. like, and I got invaded by, like, this really high-level, uh, like, red, uh, invader, and then, like, a pink one came, and, like, then we both, like, like, turned on that guy, and, like, neither of us actually succeeded in killing him, but I was, like, laughing my ass the whole time, anyway. It's like, yes, the power of friendship. We will work together. <laughs> an anime bunny girl mod for Sekiro, so I have to stream this now. Ooh! Ooh! That sounds pretty good. I want. Usagi mode. <laughs> oh, I just... Now I remember. Um, I did have an experience with one of those spirits as well. Um, I had I had a blue bud with me, and then they came in, and then we just like gestured at each other for 10 minutes. <laughs> Amazing. Like didn't even continue through the level, we were just fucking around with gestures, and um, at one point we all did the like lay on your back thing with our feet forming a triangle, <laughs> and it was pretty amazing. Yeah, that, that game has, like, some unique, like, potential for really good multiplayer moments. I love it. The, the series, I should say, because, like, this happened to me in all of the ones that I've played. There's, al there's always people who, like, are just there to have fun and kind of screw with your expectations. Here's the infamously misnamed enemy, Malachi. Doesn't look, doesn't look like any other, um, like, well-known horror creature at all. Yeah. <laughs> and the ones that, the ones that are, like, similar looking, but, you know, like, further away, uh, visually are named Cthulhu. Yes. Your bat is helping. My bat is so good. <laughs> I'm serious when I say bat is better at the game than me. No? Okay. Oh, I don't like this. I'm scared of Big Sword, and I don't have my holy water to cheat. Damn, that's why! That's why! I remember now. <laughs> Come on, Bat. Oh, you almost did it. Yes, and because you can get hit like, while it's recoiling from damage. Okay, I'm just getting out of here. <laughs> it sucks. The bricks. There's something really enjoy- ooh, dark armor. There's something really enjoyable about just like crouching down while it flies over me. Dark armor. Get new sword? Oh, 
with this big nasty projectile. <laughs> uh, Sword of Hador. House of Hador heirloom. Uh, I guess I'll just stick with my icy brand for one more damage. Mm. Mm, don't kill me. Actually, yeah. It's like time over dagger. Just does uh just does regular cut damage and that's it. Okay. Um, Werewolf does not care about time. I guess because it's technically a boss. Probably stat wise, but like. <laughs> punch, punch. <clears throat> I have an idea. Werewolf? Meet friend wolf. <laughs> oh no, it didn't work. <laughs> I thought we could be friends. getting kind of tired now. I don't know what to do about this. There's more coffee. That's, that is a phrase that has probably never been uttered in the entirety of existence until just now. Congratulations, Ruggles. <laughs> you said a totally unique thing. Switching to dog instead of bat. Also, Ivy, you're getting really quiet. I keep moving my head away from the microphone. Ah, classic move. My, um, funny story, so. Ooh, Gram is nice. I have. Yeah, this this Logitech microphone that I was using for ever. Um, and then when I started streaming with my webcam, Windows oh so sneakily uh, changed my microphone over to the webcam microphone and I didn't realize for like a year. Oh God. And I just had the other mic plugged in like Pointlessly, I was constantly fighting with the uh, with USB ports, and then I I looked at my recording device and was like, oh, this whole time I haven't even been using the dang thing, and it actually sounds better. Okay. Alrighty. 
gonna, you, you gonna kill me, Minotaur? Fuck. I'm, I'm using a, uh, I'm using a secondhand Yeti Blue mic, which is actually, like, pretty darn good for a USB. Oh, yeah. And, but, but, like, actually the reason that I like this microphone is because uh, the person who gave it to me is uh, the non-rook half of Rook and Nomi. <laughs> are, are you saying this person could possibly might maybe be Nomi? Yes. Whoa. Whoa. That's... holy fuck, that's cool. <laughs> That mic's got, it's got, what, there's a word. Help me, what are words? <laughs> Sentimental value? There we go, yes! Pizzazz? Ooh, it's got some pizzazz. <laughs> it's got good mouthfeel. A little bit. I'd rather take a hit from that than one of these beautiful spinning cow skulls. Mm -hmm. How much damage do those do? I think it does like 10. Oh, 20. Nice. Yes, nearly threatening. <laughs> Miserable little piles of letters. Oh. oh yeah, I'm gonna upgrade my mic, actually, after, gosh, um, 12 years of doing, like, recording stuff with the cheapest equipment possible. <laughs> I just, like, I need to transfer money out of my bank and they're making it difficult. What are you gonna get? Uh, Audio-Technica something or other. I basically, like, I have it saved on Amazon. Splurgeon. Hmm? You splurging? Splurging a little bit. It's still, like, it's only a couple hundred dollars. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm an efficient splurger. Hey, here, Valerie. Thanks for, thanks for, uh, telling all I'm with us. This is great to have you. Oh, yeah. Later, Val. Hope you're doing all right. Is it for the psychological warfare boss? <laughs> <laughs> it's also the hey, look at these. You might recognize these sprites. Again, kiss girl? Maybe? She seems pretty cool. She has ice power. She's cool. Oh my god, have you seen Castlevania anime? I have not. Oh my god, please. Watch it. It's amazing. Um. I'm bad at watching things on my own. Wait, say that again? I, I have never seen Cypher do that before. I didn't know she could raise the others as zombies. That's oh! Cool. That's yeah, that's kind of cool. If only she had raised both of them. <laughs> but yeah, the, the Castlevania anime is, uh, like, like a Castlevania 3-like-ish sort of deal. It's not like the, um, oh god, what was it, the Devil May Cry anime? I think I watched like one episode of that at an anime convention. 
and it's just okay. bad. Yeah, no, it's it's good. All right. I like good things. There's a false false flare in this Oh yes, thank you. Axe versus sword. Not not a winner, apparently. See if what now? See if the secret floor is on this side. I don't think it is, but I can't remember exactly where it is. Wait, is or it in this room? Just... Mist could pass. <laughs> Mist could pass. Unmolested. I... I'm pretty sure it is in that room, yeah. 